Hello artist. Today we are going to be painting our ancient Chinese vases. So at the beginning of our lesson, we talked about how these vases were painted with a pigment called cobalt. So to make ours look like they have cobalt, we are going to be using blue watercolor pencils. So you can choose the light blue or the dark blue. That is up to you. You could use both. But what we are going to do <clears throat> is we're gonna take this pencil and we're not going to color the whole vase. That would be a lot. We can take our pencil and color in certain sections and we can also make an outline. And I will show you how it will be painted even though we're using a colored pencil. Right, so I did two different examples. One is coloring it in and one is giving it an outline. So all we need to do is take plain water on a brush and we are going to wake up the paint that we drew onto our paper. So with the outline, I'm just going to wake it up near the bird and then I can start to pull my brush away from the bird and the paint will look like it's fading out. So that is how we would paint the outline. We just wake up where that colored paint is and then you can take plain water to fade it out. The second way that we could add color was coloring the whole shape in. If you do that, all you need to do is wake up the color, but keep your brush inside those lines. If I were to take my brush and go across, the color would also go across. So we're just gonna keep our brush where we want the color. All right, boys and girls, once your whole vase is decorated and activated, it needs to go to the drying rack so that the paint can dry. I hope you had fun. Bye.